What's up guys, how's it going? Avid Geek here and today I have another unboxing for you guys. It's been a while since I've unboxed kind of anything technological, but I just got this in the mail and hopefully I'm going to use this to improve some of my video and audio and all that kind of stuff. But uh, anyways, this is it. Take a look. Isn't it cool? It's a super unidirectional condenser microphone. So this is actually by Newer. So we're going to go ahead and unbox this and take a look and see what's inside. This is the shotgun mic like I mentioned from Newer. This was about $32 from Amazon. Really inexpensive compared to some other mics I've seen. One of the popular mics is a Rode mic, um, made by Rode. And that mic is a lot smaller, it's condensed, but it's very expensive. I think it's like the cheapest 250 maybe, 250 bucks, where this is $32. I'm not saying they're on the same quality or anything like that. I don't know yet, I just got this. I literally just got this from the door, um, maybe like an hour ago. I had to take care of something first before I film this video. But anyways, let's go and open this up. Let's take a look at the box first though. Here we go. This says it's made by Cool Sounds. I don't know why. Maybe they changed the boxing. It looks nothing like the one I ordered on Amazon. But uh, it does have a sticker on the other side. It says newer. You'll probably see it there. So let me zoom in on that. It's upside down, but it says newer. So nothing else special about the box. Um, just has kind of a picture, really generic looking box. Nothing special. So what you do is you just slide this out, just like so. Move that slip case to the side. And then you have this thing. This thing is kind of, it's actually a, it's not, how do I put this? This is not the same material as this. It's not some kind of just piece of wood. There's wood inside of it. It's kind of an old school case almost. So it's got kind of compressed wood with a nice covering, almost like a cloth covering, but not quite. It's not high quality, but it is a case to protect your mic and you can take, put it away and put it in here. So let's open it up. Ta-da! There we go. There's a shotgun mic from Newer. So here's the mic itself. It's in a nice piece of foam to protect it. Let's take a look and see what we have inside first. We have the cord. Now this cord has a 3.5 millimeter jack on one end of it. As you can see here, this will plug into my camera on the side. And then you have this, which is the XLR, the auxiliary output from the shotgun mic to your camera. We got one battery, because this thing does run on batteries and needs power. So we have a battery here. I think it, maybe it only takes one, which is pretty nice. It's nice to give you a battery. I don't know what brand this is, Ignite. Never heard of it, but it's nice to have a free battery, right? We have the windscreen. So this is to help prevent some of the noise from wind. If you have this outside and you're doing like a movie, um, even if I'm having it on top of my camera and there's a lot of wind, this is supposed to help reduce that. Then we have, I'm gonna put this down for a second. We have hey, a mic clip. So this probably fits onto the shoe. That's what it looks like. So here's the mic clip, right? This will hold the mic in it. And on the bottom here, we have this. This is actually what tightens on top of the shoe. So just to give you an example, here we go. Here's the camera. We take this, we slide this onto the shoe, right? Just like so. And then we turn this to tighten it down. So now it'll stay, it won't slide out. And then you put the mic on top of here, which I'll show you in a moment. We got a couple other looks like stand things. If you have a regular mic stand, you can actually use this on the mic stand. So it's it doesn't have the metal like it normally does on a normal mic holder head thingy. Usually there's like metal inside to keep it from stripping. But anyways, this is it's free, comes with it. So I'm not gonna argue. Of course, then we have some kind of instruction manuals. This looks like it's from who knows where, Japan, China. So here's the instruction manual. If you can see that it's all in another language, everything, even the product certification, the product <laughs> warranty card, all in another language. Um, there is nothing here to tell me how to operate this thing. So if I can figure this thing out and hopefully maybe I can do a how-to video or something, um, I'll have to try to just mess around with it. So anyways, here we go. This is it. This is the product itself, what you are waiting for, right? This is the shotgun mic. Very cool. And it's called Cool Sound. So Cool Sound, as you can see here, Cool Sound MAG18 unidirectional electric condenser microphone spell electric with a t r e t interesting so we have a switch here to turn it off we have a switch to turn it to normal and we have a switch to turn it to tally so the normal and tally actually affect on how affects the mic and how it picks up so this thing screws and that's where you place your battery so yeah it looks like it only takes one AA battery pretty cool so that's kind of it on the bottom, as you can see here, this is where you plug in the XLR. So that's where you'll plug in, like I mentioned, this cord into there. 
let's see here, like so, like that, and it's in. Just push the button to release, and you're good. The weight of it, you know, for the initial impression of it, it feels really light. It's super light, guys. This thing is, it weighs almost nothing. Um, but it doesn't feel cheap. The the metal, it doesn't feel like it's going to just buckle in. It's not going to just break. Um, it feels pretty sturdy. I mean, I'm not going to try to bend this, but it feels pretty sturdy. The, the buttons itself, the switch, it feels nice and tight. So it doesn't feel like it's just going to, it's not going to hold in its position. Because um, the worst thing is if you have to set for one thing and it just slides to another position and you're losing the setting that you want, right? Um, it looks built pretty well. This part in here is not like a fabric mesh. It's actually a metal mesh, um, which is really nice. So not bad. But this thing, however, is all bent. As you can see, it's all bent in to fit in the box. <laughs> Sorry. It's all bent in to fit in the box. So I wish they didn't kind of bend it that way. So this is the new setup I'm going to try to be using. Uh, probably from the videos from this point on, you'll be seeing with this mic. So let me know how it sounds. Let me know how this works out. I'm going to kind of give my own opinion, probably do a review on this. Uh, see how all this works inside, outside, just in different situations. And how all this works with the windscreen. Maybe I'll have like a fan blowing in front of it or whatever. So anyways, guys, that was my unboxing of this newer unidirectional uh, shotgun mic. Like I said, it's really inexpensive. If you want one of yourself, get it on Amazon. It's the cheapest place to get it. I haven't really seen it anywhere else. Um, I don't know how well it is yet. Like I said, if you want to wait for my review or see some other reviews, there are a couple other reviews. Uh, there's not really that many great reviews on it though out there. But if you want to wait for my review, you're more than welcome to. Or just send me a line. Ask me how does it work in this case? How does it work in that case? Give me some ideas on how you want to see this thing utilized. And I'll try my best to do that and film it and give you my opinion on it. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you like my video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share this video because that helps me a lot. It helps with my subscriber base. It helps with um, growing this channel. It helps with even getting suggestions for different things to, to take a look at, different games to play and so on. I play games and do all kinds of stuff. So anyways, guys. Thanks for watching. If you have any comments, anything at all, any questions whatsoever, leave them in the comment section down below. So thanks again for watching, guys. I know this is a little long, but thanks for watching. Peace out.